Welcome to another uh, Ride Along with Goggles tutorial and this time it's going to be update on map mods and we're going to uh, we're going to put my current map mod set in a uh, profile that I I just have recons map in right now so let's have a look at what we got in this profile so this is my uh, MTG profile so uh, mod, um, Model 3 Gaming it's got the uh, P351 and Mac B61. So what we got is ProMods Canada. We see all this stuff up here. We've got uh, the Bellingham Heights Improvement, which adds a whole bunch of stuff in here. So you can see this is that road up to Bellingham Mountain where the uh, rustic or uh, deep grove logging site is. And it adds in this road here, this road, and uh, Nooksack or Middle Fork, whatever they want to call it, and there's stuff in here. There's, you know, there's a Walmart next door to the home shop here, which has been added. Uh, we've got uh, Lee Bear Dollar Store. We've got a service area and a and a park area up here, which is really nice. And he's added a couple back doors into the mountain, which are there in the game, but it's been completely redone down in this area here and this road that connects in so this whole area is all new uh, let's see what else do we got we got uh, Alaska and we've got the road up to Alaska if you want to drive the road it joins in up here at uh, Toke and it comes all the way down joins into ProMods Canada so you can drive that if you want it's kind of cool I've done it a few times um what else is added in here uh well there's all the recon stuff so troy uh the logging site there we've got um in uh shelby farms and leg arms house or walker walker farms sorry what you got going on down here oh look at that oh yeah the grain bins right i haven't been down there in a while We've got um, Hell Creek Ranch right here. We've got uh, Broadus, which is a uh, is a, sort of a collection site where you'd bring the uh, cattle in off the range. Uh, it's just sort of a, it's a pen area. We've got Cody, and in here we've add, he's added uh, the ranch there you can own. It's a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, Powder River. Uh, we've got. Um, Dalhart, there's an ownable ranch right here. Another one here. And there's Bovina, Hell Creek Feeders, another one you can own. And the garage, we're in, in Amarillo, which is right here. So we jump out and have a look around. So there's the Volvo dealership across the road. Got this great big yard here with the uh, lawn tractor hanging in the air. <laughs> and uh, let's see what else do we have here. We've got um, Reforma. So this is all the Mexico and lots of fun. So much good stuff in here. And if you want to get into some crazy roads, this middle section is for you. Or this great big, uh, <laughs> this pit here. This is driving down around the edge of a pit as it goes deeper and deeper and deeper into the ground. And you end up way down there, and that's a long way down. That's pretty cool. We'll have to do it in a video soon. Uh, we've got the Pacific Islands, so we've got Hawaii. So it's Hawaii. And also I see we've got Palau now, which I've been over and had a look at. Which is kind of cool, too. I haven't done any loads out of there. But there's a home garage here and uh yeah i think that's about it so we've got quite a bit of uh map mod going on here where am i going there we go so uh let's figure out how to get it oh yeah what else is added in here um casa grande gila bend goodyear quartzite uh blythe parker glamis Raleigh, Indio, Palm Desert, El Centro, Holtville, 
all these things are added in as part of the uh, reforma and we've got the some of these are better arizona uh, which we've got too so project better arizona so we've got a whole bunch of stuff going on so let's get on with it so what i'm going to do i'm going to pause the video is this profile's already done we're going to go do this to a different profile so uh, I'll pause the video, I'll come back when I get in the other profile, and we'll start updating it. Okay, so we're back, and uh, this time we're in the, my uh, Roland uh, 389 profile, and this only has the recon map in it, so as all my profiles do. <laughs> so I didn't have one that didn't have this in it, so as we can see when we look at the world map, we've got... Uh, Amarillo, Bovina, Dalhart, we got, you know, we got all the things we just mentioned, Powder River, Broadus, uh, Hell Creek Ranch, Troy, and that's it. We don't have anything else. So we don't have all this improvement up here in Bellingham. You see, you can get, you can get to the uh, logging site. It doesn't show you the hidden road between here and here. There is one. And uh, anyway, let's get on with it. So I'm going to put a, um, uh, we got to get out to the mod manager. Uh, I'm going to put a link to uh, all of the active links to all of these mods, uh, map mods, so you can find them easy and get them into your mod manager. And then you'll be able to do exactly what I'm going to do here. And what I do is I get them on my phone. And, uh, oh boy, I should have done that beforehand. <laughs> um, we're going to go... To find them on here if so I can get started. That was uh, poor thinking on my part. It shouldn't take me too long to find it. So what I do is I just take photos of the uh, mod order and I put them in in a specific way so that... Um, let me see if I can get the right one here. Yeah, we want to end up at the beginning is yeah okay so the first thing we what we want to do is we want to put the uh, the mods in in the order okay so let me explain something first just in case you're not familiar familiar with the map mods and if you are this would just be a little recap what happens is when you take something like you take this step deck and you throw it in here it's up here at the top of the mod order and you want it down where the trailers would go so you put it over here and then you hit this button at the bottom and it shows it puts it right down in the bottom and then all you have to do is click it up from the bottom this far to get to where your trailers are and all of the map mods are going to be on the bottom below all this stuff down here with recons stuff so we need to get it all down here so what happens if we put something down in the bottom after this one it's going to come down underneath it but uh let me um yeah we'll just start with the maps and it, hopefully it'll start to make sense when uh when you see it so we're going to use the search function up here to find the things we want and uh the first thing we're going to want is uh what do we got here uh, Alaska north to the future so and that's the pro mods thing so we're going to type in pro mods get a bunch of pro mod stuff so here we go we got all this pro mod stuff I'm going to want this specific map here but I'm not going to put it in right away because it's going to go right on top of everything later on so we want um, the pro mods definitions and you can see we have two we have one here for convoy and we have one here that's the one you created when you download your pro mods. Uh, it cre you create one and it sort of figures out what your PC wants. And you can tell it a little bit about what you want. Anyway, so we want pro mod stuff. So um, and we do know that looking at my photo list, we want this one to be the first one in our list. So we'll put it in first here. And next up is going to be uh, the... Um, uh, assets, ProMod Assets. So we find the assets, we click it into here. And next up is Definitions, and I'll put the Convoy one in for giggles. And then after that we have, uh, let me get to my next photo. 
do 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 gotta go the right way here. What am I doing? Going the wrong way. Um the map package and then models. So map and then models. Where's the models? Right here. So we got all that stuff. And now let me see what are we gonna have coming up next. Let's gotta get this in the right uh, here we go. Oh I missed a couple at the top. Darn they have to be in here. That is going to be SCS map improvements Bellingham and the pro mods this one right here the SS improvements so let's get that in there and let's type uh, in um, was it Bellingham or we just go SCS improve oh that doesn't do it SCS map let's try that there we go and we want the fix so this is the one we want so what we need is this one i'm going to put it right here and this one is going to be the very first thing in so you can see i've got them in the this is going to be the opposite order and it's at the opposite order of the map list so anyway you'll it'll all come clear when we go a little further into this so uh, let's figure out what we need next is going to be SCS map improvements base. Oh, I should have left that thing there. Map improvements base. That's going to go after pro mods. And after that, we have SCS map Bellingham Heights. That goes next. And then next up, we have the Recon Lobster expansion models. We already have that in here. So we'll just put that back up at the top. And after that is going to come his expansion. So we'll throw that back to the top. So, and this is, you'll see how this all works shortly. So anyway, after ATS expansion, need to get this cleared off so we can use our search. And what's next? Project Better Arizona. So we got to go Project Better Arizona. And the first one in the list is going to be the connections. That's this one. And that one is going to come after it. And after that, we want Hawaii Ferry Fix. So we'll type in Hawaii. Throw that in there. Backspace out of there. After that is um, MUO Reforma LA Ferry. Oh. oh, don't tell me. It's, why wouldn't we find that in here? Oh, because I have a space? Yeah, M-U-O. And we want both of these, so we don't need them both in the same part in the order, but we will remember to straighten it out. So we want the LA Ferry patch next. And we're going to put this one in here now because we're already here, but we'll sort it out in the order. You'll see when we get to that. Next up, Los Angeles Cruise Terminal. Los Angeles Cruise Terminal, so throw that in there. And then we want Pacific. And here we want the map def map, that's that one. And we want the map models, that's the order they're going to be in. Upside down, of course. <laughs> and after this is that other MUO, so we got to take this second one and move it to the top. Now that order is all looking good. Now what comes after that? Reforma Noresta Beta 1.5. So this is going to be all the Reforma stuff. So the Nor Noresta Beta, that's next. And after that, we've got the Los Altos Beta. Throw that in there. Then the Reforma, the main map right there. And then we want the Mega Resources. So to get the Mega Resources, we're going to go type in Mega. And we want the Mega Resources. 
And after that, Alaska North to the Future. So I'll just type in Alaska. And that should be everything. Yep, that's it. So that's all our map mods. And that didn't take too long. We got them all thrown in there pretty quick. So using that search function is a really good way to get it done. And then now what we got to do, they're all in the wrong order. And they're in the wrong end of the map. But we need them at the bottom. So we're going to go in here and click the first one, which is the bottom of the list. That's the first one we put in that we want at the top of our map mod order. So we put it to the bottom. Go back here. And find the next one right there and the next one and we'll keep going like this till we get them all down there always you know click the bottom one throw it down to the bottom and we're reversing the order so you can see here this is the mod order we're looking for. So that's why we're that's why I put them all upside down at the at the top. So we can just go in here and uh, put them all in order now, like just clicking them to the bottom and it's gonna work. Get the recon stuff down there. Good old recon. And This is, I find, I and this is the same thing I do when I'm putting a Ruta truck in or a Roland that has all of the uh, the parts. You get this file and that file and whatever. I put them in upside down at the top and then I scoot them to the bottom and they end up in the right order. Yeah, I just put them in upside down. Oh. I, th I think I got something out of, I clicked something wrong here. The, uh, that one has to be up one, I believe. Uh, do, do, do. No. Um, yeah, I got something wrong here. This one here, I must have clicked on it in the wrong place. That's the Reforma LA Ferry Patch, and that has to be above the ferry, I think. Very fix right below it and above there, right there. That's where that goes. Whew. Glad I noticed that. Uh, then comes this patch, the MEO compatibility. We're almost there. All the Reforma stuff in order. What I'll do, I'm going to load this right away, and I'll just uh, pause the video while it loads, because this is a whole lot of maps, and it'll take it a little while to load. So let's just scan our eyes over it and just see from, based on what I know, that we got it all right. Yeah, that's good. So I'm going to hit confirm changes and pause and come back. Okay, we're back. So it's telling us that uh, game change detected, yet, yet, and you've probably all seen this before. So anyway, we'll just click back there, and we'll be at that Volvo dealership. Let's look at our um, world map now, see how different it looks. Oh yeah, well there's all the uh, Mexico, all that stuff we saw like Casa Grande and Gilliband and everything. You've got... Uh, Hawaii and Palau and Alaska. Uh, Promots Canada, Bellingham Heights Improvement, and all our recon stuff. And uh, yeah, we got a whole bunch of more driving to do. <laughs> And so what I'm going to do, uh, so now we've got this in here, and that's the whole purpose of the video. So we're not going to uh, oops, belabor this a whole bunch, but I'm going to show you how to get around. So hopefully you've got the uh, dev console configured, and if you don't, I have a tutorial on how to do it. 
So say, for example, we want to go and see something and we haven't been there before and, you know, maybe you don't have a whole lot of money in the bank and you don't want to be paying to quick travel and you want to go to, um, oh, let's go up to Alaska for, let's go someplace. Where do we want to go? Hmm. I wonder if we can... What's a Delta Junction? Can we actually... We should be able to go there. It's on the map. Let's see. Go to Delta Junction. So we're going to hop in the vehicle. And there's our Reforma. Oh, you see all kinds of things on that splash screen. We got a red line instead of a yellow line that, you know, the progress. And that red one, that indicates you've got ProMods Canada going. And there's a symbol, obviously, and that splash screen was... Uh, a reforma one so what we can do to travel now that we've got our we're all set up we're going to go uh, and hit the zero get under the vehicle we have you know or the tilde key would, um, however you want to get in the dev console this is the way i have it set up anyway we want to hit um, go to so uh, what did I say? Uh, what was it called again? Jeez, I forget already. Oh, man, I forgot. Something. Oh, that's no good. Well, let's just go to Valdez. <laughs> if you can spell that. Oh, no, I should pick one with two two parts to the name. Huh. Oh, shoot. Yeah, let's, let's stick with the plan here. Let's get out of there. Uh, we want to escape. Let's look at the map again and do this right. We wanted to go to... Oh, the Alcan border. That's kind of cool. Go see that. I wonder if we can actually fly there. Let, let's see if we can. Alcan border. Let's see if we can go there. It has it on the map. We'll go under here. We're going to hit... Um... Oh, we don't have to go under here. What am I doing? We just need to... Oh, yeah, yeah, I have to, to travel. So let's, um, oh, I'm setting it. No, sorry, guys. Hang on. Let me let me get out of there. Get out of there. We don't need to be under here. We just need to hit the tilde key. That's it. Just have to hit tilde on your keyboard. And now we're going to go, um, oops, with the go to Alcan border. So when you do two, uh, it's a, uh, two parts to the name with a space in it. You're going to hit a quote and then Alcan space border and the quote. Let's see. Yeah, it's taking us there. So once you get, you know, your scene all settles down and you're there, you can hit the tilde key again and here's the Alcan border. So what we'll do is we'll go over here a little bit we got to uh, get ourselves turned around. And what we'll do, Yukon, larger than life. And it's in bilingual. Plogland <laughs> Kinature. My terrible French accent. Anyway, here we are. We'll have a look. Oh, we should jump right up here onto this thing and have a look. Excuse us, folks. Don't mean to photobomb you. And we're going to park ourselves right there. Better make sure the parking brake's on. Press the key. Welcome to Alaska. Gateway to the 49th state. This is all pretty cool. Okay, we got bigger problems. Help stop the spread of invasive plant life. Huh. Spot a suspicious plant. Call. <laughs> wow. It's interesting. Anchorage, 421 miles. Oh, getting these guys photo shoot. National border. 
that's all the uh, border between Canada and the U.S. is, a whole bunch of those stone pylons. You'll find them carved in the wilderness, like just in the middle of nowhere, like wherever that one was back there. There'll be a line of those. I don't know how far apart they are. They're pretty far apart. But right across the border, like if it's through forest, there's a strip cut through the forest, and like every mile or a couple miles, there's one of those things, and there's... There's no fence, there's no nothing, that's it. It's pretty funny. Anyway, so here we are, we're on our map. We're looking, at, we're up in uh, the Alcan border. So that's a really good way to get around. So say, for example, you haven't explored any place yet, and you haven't been anywhere, and you want to get a jobs in a, in a city uh, that you haven't been to. Well, how do I get there? I haven't explored it. I haven't found it. So what you can do is simply we'll do that flying thing and let's pick one that we haven't been to. Uh, we could go to Fox River. Oh no, we should find one that's got a, uh, that logging site's way out there. Mm, what's an easier one? Homer and the rustic site right there. So let's go to Homer, Alaska. So we're, once again, we're gonna do the dev console thing. We're gonna bring up the go to. If you hit up arrow, it brings up your last command. And it's Homer. We don't need any quotes because it's one word. And we'll go to Homer. Once the map all settles down, hit the tilde again. And now we're up above it. We can fly around a little bit. Get a handle on where that, where was that uh, job site? Oh, well, we got to get our map going here a little better. Oh, there it is over there. Okay, so you can just fly over to the Fly over here, scoot up the road. I like these Pacific logging trucks here. Those are so cool. It'd be cool if they were in the game. And we could plunk ourselves down right here. And now we press a button, look at a job offer. And uh, yeah, a little triple, that's cool. Utility poles to Hope BC. So we got 177 on land and 1,400 uh, on the ferry. So that's that's how I do it. Like that's like if I want to start exploring a map and I want to find my way around, um, I just uh, fly to this fly to the, the city of the location, then uh, bring my little map view up in the screen there, and I can get around. So anyway, that's. Um, should about cover it. I don't know what else I want to put in here. I do have um, uh, voice um, voice map mod um, Great America. I didn't put it in here this time, and that covers a whole bunch over here. Gets all this kind of filled in. And I'm just really hanging on for Oklahoma and what that's going to do here and get us down, cutting through this corner here, and then I'm sure Kansas is going to come after it pretty quickly. And uh, that's going to get good. I'm doing stuff up out of here. Northern Texas, northeastern Texas up into Oklahoma is going to be good. Anyway, so that's uh, Map Mods 101. And I just want to do one other thing. I want to go back to the uh, Mod Manager and just show you. Just to reiterate, as I've mentioned before in other videos about load, or load order, um, I've found that it doesn't matter where you put the skins. So and I'm always doing skins. So I've got them in and out all the time. So I just put them at the top. That doesn't really matter. And you can have them mixed up throughout here. It doesn't really matter. I used to always have them right here above trailers. But I find it just doesn't matter with skins. But the rest of it does. And so map mods go right at the very bottom. In the way, as uh, I've said before, the maps, I think of it as a big, like a sieve or a strainer or something like that, and you're lifting it up through a bunch of water, and the first thing you hit is the maps. And so you start picking up maps as you go. So this map grabs that one, that one, that one, and they start layering up, and you get through your maps. Next thing you know, you're picking up trucks. And so trucks are popping onto your map, and then your trailers. You're lifting it up. You're collecting all this stuff. 
Well, what do you need for your trailer and trucks? You need wheels. Well, let's get them after we've got the truck. You don't get the wheel and then buy the truck to match the truck. You buy the truck and put a wheel on it. Same with the trailer. You put the wheel on after. Lights come afterward. The advertising and all of this stuff. Well, you need a place to put it. So we've already grabbed our maps. by lifting up everything from the bottom. So we're getting to the mods to the map. Real name, you know, place names, gas stations, etc. We've got our trailers down there. Well, here's a mod to a trailer. It's a chrome frame. So we're picking this up as we rise up through with our big sieve scooping everything up uh, under cables for trailers. We got the you know this environmental changes with this chasing camera improvement, pivot roof cam. Uh, we got the Dallas Dallas high resolution in here. I guess I don't have JBX in this one. Um, uh, then we've got uh, our transmissions. Then Sissel's Mega Pack actually should be down here. I usually run it down right uh, there. So I'll put that down there is where I like it. Um, then above the transmissions, we've got all the sound stuff. So all the engines, interior packs, brakes, weather, and I got the skins at the top. Oh, and the GPS voice mod. Now, one other thing we're going to add to this is, uh, if we go Pro Mods again, now we're going to add the Pacific North America background. Remember, I said that at the beginning. I was going to put that on. It has to go above everything. So above these skins is generally right. I haven't tried it below the skins. probably works, but I just make sure that's right at the top. Now we can go back in and see what that looks like with the different background map. And see, once again, we've got the red progress line going across. That means it's normally yellow. That tells you you got pro, uh, pro mods in. And we've got the maple leaf added to the uh, symbol. And we've got a splash screen from uh, Reforma. And the only pay mod for all of these maps is uh, north to Alaska. So if you don't want it, uh, if you don't want to pay, I think it's 25 bucks or something for ever. It's like, I wish all the maps were like that, that you, all the pay maps, like I'm a patron of um, Reforma, but they're really good because if you're not a patron, you can get what I have right now is probably out for free already. And the only advantage to uh, being a patron is, it says on the screen, early access. So you get your, um, you get your, um, you know, first up, maybe two weeks, you'll have it before anybody else gets it. So, but they do a heck of a lot of work, so I don't mind supporting them. Um, but like I say, it's not necessary. And the link, it's the same link, takes you there. Uh, okay, so let's look at our um, world map now. See how different it looks. I think it's just, yeah, it's it's a bigger, it's faster to move around the map. We're not scrolling. Like we get to Hawaii way quicker. Yeah, that's that's a good deal. So it kind of shrinks it down a little bit. It gives you, uh, it's not as drilled in, so you can get around quicker. But anyway, that should do it. I think um, if there's any questions, certainly ask away. And you can always um, look at my other uh, tutorials. And, uh, you know, they've got all this, you know, I've got other map mod tutorials out there too. And it's kind of the same thing, but this is up to date and current. And so the links are going to work um, for what I have here right now. And uh, what I'll do is I'll figure out how to get you the images of what I was going off on my phone in order to put the, the uh, order in. And just remember, what you're after is, once again, we better go look at it again, just, just to make sure, because, you know, if, if I'm boring you, you can end the video now, but it's super important that you get the order right. And um, when you see the images, I can't get you, you know, they're, they, they go off the screen. So when I take these images of what's going on, we're going to start with 
this is the top right here. So I always put my uh, mouse cursor on the bottom and click it. So there's a yellow line there. And so you know everything in there to the bottom. That's one, one screen. And then I'll put that yellow line. I'll take it right off the screen. And then I'll click again. This is the next batch. And then there's just this little bit left here. So you'll have three images to sew together. So it's going to start with ProMods Canada SES Improvement Fix. That'll be at the top. I'll have the yellow at the bottom highlighted in yellow. And so that's one complete screen. And then you're going to have two complete screens and a little bit. And that's it. So, and uh, just to reiterate, you put them in the, you, you bring them in. So if we're bringing them in from over here, we put this one in first, then this one, that one, that in that order. And so they were at the top of, up here and they were upside down. And then we clicked them all to the bottom using this express button here in the bottom right. And they all ended up in the right order. So that saves going through, like if you see a bunch of them, just start clicking on them and throw them all over here. And then you got to go and sort the order out. I find that can be more confusing. I think we saw when we had this MUO reformer thing right here in the wrong place. I had to look at it and figure out was it go between here above there. No, it was under, you know. It just makes it a lot easier if you put them in here into the active mods in the opposite order they need to be, express them down to the bottom, and they're all going to end up in here in the right order. So I just, I think that's super helpful. And once you get your head around it, you'll go, oh yeah, that's, that's cool. All right. So as always, um, I appreciate you guys following along, and if, uh, like I say, any questions or whatever, just uh, don't be shy to ask, because I'm here to help, and uh, <laughs> hopefully I'm not helping to confuse you. <laughs> anyway, good luck with it, guys, as always. Um, appreciate you, and we'll catch you on the next one. Take care, and bye for now.